Hello everyone, welcome back to a new video. In today's video, I'm actually going to go over four new limiteds on the catalog Seal Stride. And it seems like after yesterday there was nothing really happening, that they were kind of just waiting for the weekend to come for when Labor Day Seal would have happened, but they actually made four items go limited today. Well, actually three as of right now, but it will be most likely four in a few hours. And this could be because of their birthday being today. They typically do kind of longer waves on days that are like holidays, which the birthday would count as one of those days. So we have four items here that were updated, three went limited, one just got updated, but it's most likely going limited soon. So let's go over all four of these. First off, we do have this Glitz and Glitter Heart Top Hat. This is a pretty cool one. It was a Valentine's Day item from 2018, I think, and it was decently priced. I think it was okay. It looks pretty good though. It's a nice looking top hat, and it got a decent amount of sales, so it wasn't 500 around that. So it will do pretty okay. All of the owners are not that active anymore, so I think it will do pretty decent. Definitely a bit better than some of the other recent limiteds we have gotten. So I can definitely see this as a 5,000 item over some time. So definitely a pretty nice choice for them. And after a few sales, it will definitely go up to quite a lot, so definitely not that bad a choice. Next up, Combo Egg of Trollolo. This makes sense. They've been doing egg hunts 12 eggs, so this is just the next one on the list. So they're almost done with this egg hunt, and it's a pretty cool one. It's a nice looking egg, very unique as well, since it doesn't have the regular egg shape. It has the lock on the front as well. So definitely a pretty nice one, and definitely one of my favorites from this egg hunt. It will do all right, similar to a lot of the other 2012 eggs, probably around the 500 range. So nothing too special in terms of price, but still a nice choice. Next right over here, we got King of the Dark Crop. So they're going to the Halloween items now. So I might see more of these limited soon as it is nearing October. This was the 31,000 Robux item from 2017 and it only got 100 owners exactly, I'm pretty sure. Only one person is selling it so far, so definitely going to be a pretty rare item. And definitely if you owned it, this is definitely going to be a pretty big profit for you. It looks okay, I think they could have made it look a bit better, but still it's an expensive item, so you definitely got your money's worth with this one. And the last one right over here, Rainbow Shaggy Beard. This one was updated, it probably will go limited just like Sinister Q was updated when they did the July 4th wave, but then they forgot to make it limited and they made it limited at a future date. That is probably what's going to happen with this one, so I'm just going to review it now since it is probably going to go limited. It has around double the amount of owners that the Glitz Top Hat does, but it is an older item, so might do probably around the same, honestly. Not many people actually wear beards, so it's not going to be the best item, but definitely if you have a rainbow item, this is definitely going to fit well with that. So yeah, I can definitely see it probably around the same as the Glitz Top Hat, around 2500, but still a pretty nice choice for them to make limited. So yeah, those were the four items they did decide to make limited today. Pretty cool choices. I think they're all really great items, and I definitely can't wait to see what happens in the future. So yeah, if you do want to check out any of these, I will leave them all linked in the description. And yeah, that's much for this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!